there are a lot of factors and ingredients needed for severe weather to occur. Yeah, but there's one climate pattern that could bring us a better chance for certain kinds of severe weather. Storm Team Meteorologist Rachel Dunzing explains what that is. Severe weather can happen in an instant, but we can be prepared with advanced warning. Now, we know certain weather conditions lead to a better chance for severe weather, but something that developed back in December could have an influence on our spring severe weather. It's called La Nina. La Nina is the cool phase of El Nino Southern Oscillation, commonly known as ENSO, and it developed, as I mentioned, back in December. La Nina is when the waters of the tropical Pacific Ocean are cooler than average. This influences how the jet stream flows over the United States. The jet stream plays a vital role in weather and especially severe storms across the country. With La Nina, the jet stream is a little farther north, which keeps warm, moist air pushing in from the Gulf and the Atlantic. But the cooler air stays north of the jet stream. This contrast between the warm and the cool is favorable for storm formation. Also, according to research, when La Nina is in place during the spring, there are more tornadoes and hailstorms, mainly in the south, but that increase does also include right here in North Carolina, although in comparison, it is a smaller increase. So is this going to have an impact on us this spring? So forecasters with NOAA anticipate that La Nina will be on the weak side and eventually switch to a more neutral phase by the end of spring and beginning of summer. So it may not have as much of an impact on our chance for severe weather, but we know all too well here in central North Carolina if conditions are right. So if we're warm enough, have enough instability, moisture, and some form of lift like a strong cold front, severe storms and tornadoes are possible. But no matter what happens, of course, you can count on the CBS 17 storm team to walk you through whatever severe weather heads our way. For CBS 17, I'm meteorologist Rachel Dunzing.